I'd rather just run up these stairs and ramps than climb my way slowly. That's unbecoming of a party guest. You got your tuxedo now, sir? Of course I do. I'm here to dance. Then come on in. I wonder if I'm gonna have to do a dancing minigame. Your tuxedo disguise is working perfectly. No one will recognize you in that outfit. Now, during the heist, you'll need to dance with Carmelita to keep both her and the crowd distracted. The really? only problem is, she's picky about dance partners, so you'll need to impress her first. Alright, I know just the girl for the job. Constable Neela, you look lovely this evening. I'm sorry, do I know you? I used to chase after you back in Paris. Paris? Sly Cooper? You aren't by any chance here to turn yourself in. Old Ironsides would fall out of her dress. As good as that sounds, how about a dance first? Enchanté. They really can't recognize me. I'm a raccoon. I guess that would be racist. Try to memorize the steps. Triangle, triangle, triangle. Triangle, triangle, triangle. Triangle, triangle. Circle isn't so bad. Triangle, triangle, circle. Circle, triangle, X. Circle, triangle, X. Uh, I'd rather have this than trying to actually match rhythm timing. I'm not so great at rhythm based stuff. Need to get at old Ironsides. Yes, I am. Do you mind? Not at all. <laughs> At least she accepts it. I wonder if Carmelito will realize nice. who we are. I've been dreading that this is gonna turn into like five Delicious. to ten things to remember. That would get me messed up. X. Triangle. X. That fellow is very graceful. If only you moved spice shipments as well. Oh, silence. <laughs> oh shit. XX, triangle, circle. Triangle, circle, X, triangle. Okay. Triangle, circle, X, triangle. I gotta, <laughs> I gotta make sure I memorize these when they start. Extending themselves by quite a bit. Circle, 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 X. Circle, 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 X. You can hear me, like, failing a couple of times. Because I press it, like, too early or too many times. Thank you. That was delightful. Thank you, Constable Neela. After all, it takes two to tango. Yes, and three is always a crowd. Neela, your friend here is quite an accomplished dancer. I tried to make him look good. Please, Neela, his skills far surpass you. Perhaps wow. later you and I might share a dance, Miss... Miss Fox. Carmelita Fox. And I accept. Dude, dude, Carmelita just threw Neela under the bus. That was savage! Holy hell! Also, I just realized... Her name is Carmelita Fox. Which is... Like if I was called Anthony Human. <laughs> Look, I'm just- I'm just- I'm just thinking about it. Sly Cooper- is Cooper another way to refer to a raccoon? Because I've never heard it. And then Bentley and Murray, I don't think they even have last names. But then you have Carmelita Fox. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Although, you know what? There probably are people with names, maybe not their, maybe not like something, then their last name is human. But you do have people who are named like something and then man. 
So it's not that far-fetched. It's just an amusing thing. Alright. We need to become Murray. He has to shoot down that chopper. Thankfully, I didn't fail terribly at dancing, which makes me happy. Whoops, I actually wanted to sell stuff, but this is fine. And by fine, I mean, well, I actually can't use him yet, so never mind. There. So what are your abilities like? I want to make this R2. It's a movement-based ability. Ooh, this one doesn't drain power. Nice. Okay, so I can get some verticality with this ability. Which is much needed when you have so much verticality in these levels. It's all covered in missiles and guns and stuff. Now be a team player and take it out with that rusty pre-war turret. Okay, I had a potato gun once. I bet it works just the same. <laughs> Did you have to describe it as rusty and pre-war? to keep your strength up. Lift the lever by Get rapidly pressing circle square. Okay, all right. I'll hit every single button. I'm a master at mashing the buttons, after all. Use the left analog stick to aim and hold down the R1 button to fire. But be careful. If you continue firing for too long, your guns will overheat, and you'll have to wait for them to cool down. That's all right. Yeah, these ones are a little bit more intense. So watch out, don't get too hit by missiles because that'd be bad. Yeah, I'm just firing in their direction rather than aiming along their path. I should be predicting where missiles are going. After all, they're following a very particular path. One big spiral towards me. Okay. No, just give me a break from the missiles. Yes. There are so many. I got to shoot them down. If only this were a flat cannon. Then I can just aim in the general area around the helicopter and do a decent job. Jesus, how many missiles do you have? At least my turret is connected to the building. That makes sense for me to have unlimited energy. You know, if your missiles flew straight, you'd probably have hit me by now. <laughs> they're they're too busy spiraling in patterns, so they don't the actually make the distance. Triumphant. Good work. The sky's all clear. Whew. Easy peasy. Only a little bit of sweat off the brow. All right, boys, we're ready for the next phase. My plan to get at the clockwork wings requires the use of the electric winch above the ballroom. To get control over the device, I'll need to hack the computers in Rajad's boardroom. Plus, we'll need an extra strong saw blade to cut the wings off the statue. To make a saw blade that durable, I'll need Sly to steal the gems off the headdresses on Rajad's prize elephants. 
And finally, I'll take to the field with my remote control helicopter and nullify the palace's surface-to-air defenses. That should clear things up for the heist. Are we going to bring a helicopter in for the heist? Because uh, we sure are taking a lot, a lot of things out of the air. I want to play this badly. I want to blow up service to air missiles. Oh god, I have to go all the way over there for this mission? Jeez. Hold on, let me equip my, my things here. Size destabilizer. Oh. Wap. <laughs> it lets me instant kill them, basically. <laughs> that's funny. Yeah, that's worth it. That makes fighting as Bentley a lot more tolerable. Whoops. Forgot the button on the fire. Okay, I got a little scared there. <laughs> the light panned over to me and I thought maybe there was something in the air about to just destroy me for using the bomb like that. Oh, I have to get up there. Bentley, what's your status? I'm in position with the RC chopper. All systems are go to neutralize their surface-to-air defenses. We're going to need free reign of the sky during the heist. Well, be careful. Chopper parts aren't cheap. Hostile has been sighted. Hey, Bentley, use the left analog stick to steer the chopper and hit the X button to drop bombs. If you drop lose track bombs? of the Jeep, I'll project a holographic targeting arrow. Follow it back into the action. <laughs> Yeah, alright. Oh boy, this one takes a while to take out. Okay. We didn't get the most effective bombs. Jesus. Yeah, okay. Would have liked to have been told that before the missiles start flying. Whoa, fly awesomely to dodge the missiles. I hope that one doesn't come back. Oh god, it was trying. Whoa. You know, if they just kept themselves undercover, they'd be totally fine. I wouldn't be able to do anything. Oh boy. Please do not take out my tiny chopper. It's custom built. It even looks like Bentley, which is so unnecessary, but amazing at the same time. Here I come, I'm gonna drop bombs on you. Nice flying partner. That Jeep's out of commission and we'll have clear skies for the heist. Yes, mission successful. <laughs> no one can stand against the might of my superior air superiority. Excuse me, I made whoopsies. Ow. How dare you? Oh, Jesus! Okay, I guess I'll go now. Bye, guys. Oh, gosh. Uh, I'll deal with you later. <laughs> no one will expect a bomb. Oh, no. <laughs> also, I love Bentley's voice. It's a, it, it's a fun thing. I don't think he has any more missions out here, so he can just rest on up. So where are we heading? Boardroom Brawl, Elephant Rampage. Boardroom Brawl sounds like fun. I'm heading over there. Shush, monkey. <laughs> I do not wish to deal with you right now. Oh, jeez. Oh, gosh. You know what? I guess I'm doing this mission. Find a way to get Rajan's prize elephants out of their pen. I don't know, Bentley. That door looks pretty heavy. Maybe I can crawl on that hole under the steps and find an alternate route. Oh, it despawned everything. Good, good. Hey, look at these tiny rats. Perhaps you just scared Win 
off and freak out the prize elephants. They're now outside, rampaging around the palace. That's pretty convenient. That's pretty very convenient. Thank you, little tiny rats. Wow, you sure look spooked. A job well done, Sly. Now comes the hard part. I need you to snatch the headdress jewels worn by both elephants. The jewels are firmly embedded, so keep whacking at them with your cane to knock one loose. I'll need to make use of the rooftops to get to one of the elephants' backs, but it shouldn't be a problem. Yeah, okay. I just don't want to get squashed by them, so uh, you'll have to excuse me as I take my time to not get completely demolished. Okay. Oh, shit. The elephant went a different way. Out of here! Come back, elephant! It's gonna be okay! They're just- they're tiny little rodents! You're bigger than them by significant margins! Nice! Gem for saw blade. Oh, they toss me off every time they do that. That's annoying. Sly, jump over that elephant's trunk if he tries to swat you off his back. Yeah, all right. That sounds like a good idea. Let me just get on their back in the first place. All right, this one seems like the one I can get on first. Although they also want to go into places that are just too high for me to stay on anyways. Ah, damn it! I fell off anyways. No! Come on! What the hell? I tried jumping and all, and it just didn't work out the first time. So is it scripted that I'm always gonna get knocked off? Oh, come on. That one actually hurt me. I'm not even like holding anything when I'm jumping there. I just kind of flew myself off somehow. If only the elephants could realize that they are very able to consistently knock me off by just flinging their backs backwards. Then they wouldn't have to worry about me breaking the gems on their heads, but I don't think they care about those. It's not like it's a part of them. Eh, okay. You know what? No. We're going for this elephant. Because then I can finish it off. Although finish off sounds like such a cruel statement. Are you kidding me? Ow! I just landed on you! These elephants are jerks. Now focus on the other one. At least they can't run me over. <laughs> I, I just took a big risk there trying it like that, but I, yeah, I was pretty confident that they couldn't hurt me off when I was off of them. Hey, how you doing? Where's the other elephant? Alright guys, I'm totally willing to take out all of you in a flurry of furious blows. Ow! I don't know what just happened to me. But hey, there's the other elephant! Every time it makes a trumpeting sound, we jump away. That's- that's how we keep ourselves alive. At least this guy isn't stampeding all too quickly. He could go a little bit faster. There, all the gems acquired.
<laughs> They've calmed down. They're ready to get back into the pen that they saw the rats in in the first That's place. It. With these jewels, I can make an ultra hard radial saw for the heist. Very good. I took a bit of damage there, but that's to be expected when you're handling such large, wonderful creatures. Right, I don't know how to get up there. Is it just in the back? Aha! So I do end up back here. Alright, that's fair. Yeah, I figured I'd probably go into this drain. Where there's a pipe, Sly will go crawling into it, I suppose.